Hi everybody, welcome to Goddess Unique. I'm gonna do a facial on my beautiful daughter. I'm gonna use our Moringa African Black Soap. I'm gonna use our Pure Rose Water, our Sweet Almond Oil, our Rose Cologne Clay, and I'm gonna beautify her skin today. So we're gonna start with the African Black Soap. This is Af Af actually the Moringa African Black Soap. And I'm gonna apply it to her face, give her a nice, beautiful facial, wash that face up nice and good. And create a nice lather on her face. Go around the whole face, nice and gentle, not too rough. Get around the nose, around the mouth. Areas where we have issues with acne. Hold your lips for me, please. You're gonna get around the mouth area. Get that good clean in. I'm gonna go over forehead, do the T-zone where a lot of people have acne and can't control it. So we're gonna apply the soap and leave it on only for a, a few seconds, not too long. Probably 15 to 30 seconds. I know she can handle the soap, she uses it all the time, so her face is not, is not a, you know, allergic to it. Leave that on. And then I'm going to use Goddess Unique's double-sided facial brush to get that deep clean and clean her face. Just go in circles around the face, nice and gentle. Get the neck area. Sometimes we forget the neck area, but it's part of your face. Nice and gentle circle. Circle the motions around the face. Helps decrease the dark spots, the hyperpigmentation. I like to use the soft bristles on the face to be more gentle. And then you can use the silicone part if you really want to get in there and really get rid of those white heads, those black heads, if you have pimples. All right. How do you feel, Chanel? I feel good. I like it. I'm cleaning deep in my pores. Perfect. So we're just going to do this for a few more moments and then leave it on for a few seconds after and then rinse this bad boy off. The neck area. Circular motions. face is going to feel super clean. It's going to clean out her pores. And then the next step after this is our Rose Cologne Clay to help exfoliate the skin and get rid of dark spots, hyperpigmentation, and more. So Chanel washed the African black soap off of her face, nice and clean. So now I'm gonna add the Rose Cologne clay to her face. So I always say to mix the clay in a plastic container or something that's just non-metal. So it can be glass, it can be plastic. So this is the Rose Cologne clay and it's perfect for sensitive skin. So if you have sensitive skin, pick this up. Or even when you pick up the clay for skin bundle, make sure you, you know, you can put it in the comments and that this is what you want. So I'm going to apply this to her face. I'm using a nice brush and I'm going to go all over her whole face. I always make sure I go underneath the eye area for the dark circles underneath the eyes. And like I said, this is great for sensitive skin. So if your skin is easily irritated, this is good. It's nice and light on the skin. It helps exfoliate the skin. It helps get rid of acne on the skin. It helps get rid of hyperpigmentation, dirt in the oils. Helps get rid of like acne as well. I like this. I like this mask. It's super, super soft. Your skin is gonna feel so soft after using this mask. Always make sure when you use the mask, you go around the nose as well, because we have those pores. It can get a little greasy over there. So apply it to the T zone. And the mask should look like this. When you mix it with water. 
always make sure there's more mask there's more clay than water so you can have nice thick mask so i'm gonna put this on our whole face she's gonna leave it on for like 30 minutes until it dries get that chin area a lot of people are suffering through act through our mass acne and that's the acne that we get from those face masks that we have to wear outside now due to corona so i'm gonna make sure i go through her whole face area around her whole chin her cheeks and we're even going to do underneath her chin as well because that's where we sometimes we leave the mask and a lot of people break out in those areas if you grow hair in those areas, you know, it can be dark. You know, sometimes we just don't pay attention to the neck, but the neck is definitely part of the head. So we have to pamper the whole area. See how I'm doing the whole neck? So everything is pampered. Everything is invested in. You have to treat your skin. You have to invest in your skin. All right, get underneath the eyes, avoiding the eye area, just going around. All right, get the nose. These help close the pores, detoxify the skin, pull out metals out of the skin, beautify the skin, soften the skin, rejuvenate the skin. Right, the whole area. Avoid the eyebrows. Sometimes I like to put a little bit over the eyes because just like how it's dark underneath the eyes, sometimes over the eyes it can be a little dark as well. So it's good to kind of just tackle that area as well. Make sure everywhere gets the mask. We're going to leave this on for 30 minutes and then rinse. Let it dry. How do you feel, Chanel? Feel great. Hold your lips in so we can go around the lip area. It's another little sensitive area for some people. So make sure you get it. I had a client tell me she was using the Rose Cologne Clay. She really liked how it felt. She saw a lot of difference in her skin when it came to the Dead Sea Clay Mask. You know, it's all about your skin and what you feel like works best for you. Because we all have different skin. We all have different habits eating habits, drinking habits, and it all plays a part in how our skin responds to stuff. So she's gonna leave this on her face for 30 lovely minutes. It's gonna dry, and then she's gonna rinse it off. This is our Rose Cologne Clay for Goddess Unique. So Chanel's about to rinse off the mask. It's nice and dry. So always make sure when you're rinsing off the mask, you go in circular motions. Make sure you apply a lot of water to get it off. The mask helps exfoliate your skin, helps get rid of those dark spots, that hyperpigmentation. So make sure you wash it really good, removing the mask from your face. Use warm water to help loosen the mask because it's dry, and the warm water will help remove it from the skin. So she's going to use a lot of water to rinse it off. And then when she's done, Rinsing it all off, she'll apply some cool water to her face to tighten up her pores. All right, so the rose cologne clay is now washed off of her face. So now we're gonna spray some pure rose water on her face just to give her that nice glow. I love rose water and so do you guys. It's constantly almost running out of stock. So rose water is a great great moisturizer to help tighten up the pores, soften the skin, help get rid of those dark spots. I absolutely love rose water. So we put the rose water on, we're gonna let it dry for a few seconds and then we're gonna put Goddess Unique's Sweet Almond Oil on her face. All she needs is a few drops. we we'll make sure we go all over her whole face, go underneath the eyes to help her decrease those dark circles underneath the eye area, around her lips, around her nose. Rose water helps decrease dark circles. It helps brighten the skin. It's an amazing moisturizer. It softens the hell out of your skin. Gives you a nice glow. A lot of you guys always compliment how much the rose water has improved your skin. 
Yes. Sweet almond oil. Make sure I get on her neck. Massage it into her body. Make her feel amazing. <laughs> so we're going to also use Goddess Unique's Amethyst Facial Roller. The Amethyst Crystal is known to calm you down, relax you, and it's also known to help tighten the pores, soothe in the skin, and give you a nice dewy complexion. So, the big part is for the whole face. So I'm gonna go over her whole face with it. It's nice and cool, right? Yeah. Right, so it's gonna help tighten those pores. See that glow she has going on? It's gonna help with the absorption. The big part is for her whole face. And when I'm ready to use the small parts for underneath the eye area, so it's good for dark circles, deep puffing underneath the eyes. Go on each eye, soothing the face. It's nice spa treatment right in your house. It's available in our luxurious skincare collection as part as well as our skincare accessories and this is a nice calming crystal it helps with your intuition so sometimes you may feel like something is not right the crystal can help you with that i love amethyst it's actually my birthstone crystal so make sure i go over her whole face with it and it's going to help absorb the sweet almond oil into her face Give her a nice glowing complexion, relaxing her, making her feel good, giving her brighter skin. So everything I use on her skin is going to help brighten her skin, reduce hyperpigmentation, those dark spots, acne, just give her overall beautiful skin, make her feel amazing because you know why you deserve it pampering your skin investing in your skin is super important you work hard you deserve it so grab goddess shooting's luxurious skincare collection grab our african black soap pure rose water amethyst facial roller sweet almond oil a moringa african black soap we have so many other skincare accessories to make you feel beautiful, give you that spa feeling right in your house. So shop goddessunique.com today. How do you feel, Chanel? Feels good. Mm. <laughs> soothing. <laughs> really is soothing. <laughs> Gotta sneak that calm.